My brother was a Vietnam veteran. He was in the Navy and seeing the flags flying around when I joined the military in 1980, um, I just always said that I was going to support the POW MIAs, the ones that never returned. And so I took it upon myself when I started working at American Airlines that I was going to set up a table down in the break room, our break room at the airport. And so once I set that table up, people were questioning me what the table meant. And I, to I told them that it was a, pers a prisoner of war, a missing uh, uh, in action uh, table. And so the management uh, decided that uh, that they wanted to move it upstairs, and I set it upstairs at the gate, at our veterans' gate. I've had on many occasions, uh, if I'm upstairs in the atrium, there by the gate, uh, they'll stop, they'll shake my hand, uh, thank me for my service. Those that are not from the United States, uh, those that come from abroad, from overseas, they'll stop, take a look at the Medal of Honor wall, they look at the table and they will ask questions. What it means to me is the representation that there are still veterans that are out there uh, that have never been uh, found or, or their remains have never been recovered and that they're still out there. And the table rep for me it represents that we need to bring those veterans back home. They're not forgotten. The POWs and the MIAs are, are not forgotten.